Hello guys and welcome to Think United TV. It's your boy Listo. So GFA boss Ket Okreku has confirmed the nationality switch of six Ghanaian players and they are Terry Glamte, Inaki Williams, Muhammad Salusu, Steven Ambrosio, Patrick Pfeiffer and Ransford Yeboah. I mean Muhammad Salusu doesn't need any nationality switch but he has it is official that Mohamed Salusu has now accepted to play for Ghana. So maybe that's why he put his name there. But the one player that we are going to talk about in this video is Ransford Yeboah. I'm sorry I cannot say his last name because it's a German name and I don't know how to say it. So Ransford Yeboah is the guy that we are going to talk about in this video. Who is Ransford Yeboah? What position does he play? What team does he play for? And how is he going to help the Ghana Black Stars? So if you are interested in this video... Please do subscribe to this channel. Like the video, okay? It's very important, okay? Like this video. Like my video. Subscribe to this channel and share it as well. Ransford Yeboah was born on September 13, 2001 and is a professional footballer who plays as a forward for Bundesliga 2 club Hamburger SB. He is a former youth international for Germany. He has since switched nationality to represent Ghana. Ransford Yeboah was born in Berlin to a Ghanaian father and a German mother. He has played a youth football for Mainvar Berlin, SEC Berlin and Hertha Berlin in Germany before joining the youth setup of Dynamo Dresden in the summer of 2019. Ransford made his debut for Dresden as a substitute in a 2-0 away defeat to Nuremberg. In February 2020, Ransford signed a three-year contract with Dynamo Dresden lasting until 2022. He appeared seven times for the club during the 2019-2020 season as they finished bottom of the Bundesliga 2 and were relegated to Bundesliga 3. On October 2020, his contract was further extended to 2023 before scoring his first goal two days later in a 3-0 victory over SV Mepen. After providing the assist for Dresden's first goal in the first half stoppage time, he converted a cross to put Dresden 2-0 up in the 59 minutes. He later tested positive for, for COVID-19 in mid-April 2021, but returned to first team action for a 2-0 victory over Victoria Cohn on May 8, 2001. Dynamo were promoted back to Bundesliga as champions of Bundesliga 3 with runs for scoring 7 goals in 34 appearances across the 2020 and 2021 season. Ransford made 30 appearances for Dynamo Dresden during the 2021-2022 season scoring five goals as the club finished 16th before losing to Kaiser Luton in the relegation playoff and were re therefore relegated again to the Bundesliga 3 side. On June 28, 2020, it was announced that Ransford has signed for Bundesliga 2 club Hamburger SV on a four-year contract for a fee of 1.2 million euros. Being born to a Ghanaian father and a German mother, Ransford was able to choose to represent either the countries at international level. So on September 2021, he made his official debut for German under 21 national team, coming in as a substitute for Mukoko at the 73rd minute of a 6 0 win against. San Marino in the 2023 European and the 21 Championship qualifiers. In July 2022, the president of the Ghana FA, Ket Okriku, announced that Ransford Yeboah was one of the few players that had officially switched allegiance to represent Ghana senior national team. Overall, Ransford Yeboah, he is he's a striker. He is 20 years old. He is six feet tall which is good for a striker he wears the number 11 jersey for hamburger he made 69 appearances for dynamo dresden and scored 12 goals he is yet to play for hamburger fc because he just signed a new contract 
he has played for German and 21, just one appearances and scored no goal. So, guys, this is all about Rand for the boy. His career is very, is very, it's too early. Like I say, he's only 21 years old. And then we are yet to see how good this guy is and how he can help the Ghana Black Star. Should he be selected to go to the World Cup with the Ghana Black Star. So guys, this is all about Ransford Yeboa. Let me know in the comment section below what you think about him. Will he be a good addition to the Ghana Black Stars or should we look somewhere else? So thanks for watching my video. Like I said, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in my next one. Peace.